In this video, we'll look at the basic usage of the duplicate elements node. After creating a geometry node tree in the default cubes object, when we add the duplicate elements node, we get a completely unexpected screen. To make it a little easier to understand, let's switch to instance mode. When we enter instance mode, the unformula points we have seen will disappear. This is because the default cube to which the current geometry node is applied is not in the instance state. After adding the geometry to instance node, the cube becomes visible. Duplicate elements node, as the name suggests, is a node that duplicates the ones in the set mode. Since it is currently in instance mode, it clones this instance basically in place. If we enter amount as 10, 10 cubes are duplicated at the current location. But using it like this doesn't make any sense unless it's a very special case. Let's set a set position node to arrange the 10 duplicated cubes. If we add a math node and connect to a duplicate index socket, we will now see 10 instances that have already been duplicated. If we add a combine XYZ node, we can arrange them at regular intervals only along the desired axis. If we set the math node to multiply, we can adjust the spacing. If we apply the duplicate elements once more, we can duplicate this entire current state. We can also add a compare node for additional control over selection. That's it for this video.